Priya, I need thee. Oh, bless me now, my Savior. I come to you. I need thee. Oh, I need thee. Every hour, I need thee. Oh, bless me now, my Savior. I come to you. I need thee every hour. I need thee. I need thee. Oh bless, oh bless me now, my Savior. I come to you. It is Jesus that we come to, brothers and sisters. It is the Holy of Holies the Lamb of God who takes away the sins of this earth. Many people have good words in their mouth but they ain't got no power. Many people in the pulpit that we listen to can speak a good word but they ain't got no power. Every now and again we need to understand whose blood it is that cleansed us. Uh, whose words it is that keeps us. He is the keeper of those that diligently and consistently seek him. Uh, he's an answerer to those who question his validity and his authenticity. He will show you where you are in him. If you will only humble yourself and bring yourself into a place of prayer. If you will only humble yourself and know that you are just the clay and that the potter fashioned and formed you. The clay doesn't tell the potter what to make. Uh, the clay doesn't have an input. Uh, it is the potter who decides what is to become of the clay. Because once the potter has made the decision then the vessel that is formed becomes a property of the potter. That means that anything that tries to hinder or destroy the assignment that the clay is coming to fulfill, the potter has the responsibility to fight for the vessel. That's why this morning, it is a simple song, a very well-known song, a very well-known song, I need thee every hour. What you're looking at, for those of you who might be a little bit confused, is what is called the prayer wall. Uh, prayer mantle has a prayer wall where the names of families, our loved ones. Everybody who prays with prayer mantle has their name on the prayer mantle prayer wall. And it is the wall that we come this morning to remind ourselves that the focus should never be on an individual. My God. The focus is not on no preacher. 
no prophet, no bishop, no archbishop, no uh, evangelist, no pastor. Uh, you are just a vessel that the voice of the Lord speaks through if you are authentic. Notice I place emphasis on the word authentic because we've got too many fakes in the system. The system is full of counterfeits. The system is full of manipulators. The system is full of those who come just to tickle your flesh. The system is full of those who lie to you because of what they want to get into their pockets. But this morning, I just want you not to see me, but I want you to hear the voice of the one who made a pronouncement that I have no business allowing the devil to destroy me. I'm going to die. I'm going to go through the trials and the tribulations. On my way to Golgotha, on my way to hanging on the cross, the lions, the serpents, and the scorpions are going to come out. What you don't understand is some of these lions and these scorpions and these serpents are going to be church folk. Uh, they're going to be on the path. They're going to be on the way leading up to the cross because the statements that are going to be made is going to be because they've seen me minister. Was this not the one who called himself the Messiah? Was this not the one who called himself the beloved? He said he was the son of the most high. But you see, in that vessel that was fashioned and formed for Jesus, who is the Christ, uh, he had no say in how the potter was going to formulate and form him. Because wrapped up in his flesh was destiny and the destiny that was on the inside of him was that he needed to die this morning under the sound of my voice hearers of the word don't just reduce yourself to be a hearer it is easy to hear but you need to be a doer of the word. Your name is not on this prayer wall by accident, nor by coincidence, because those words don't exist in the word of Jehovah. Your word is on, or your name, which is a word, is on this prayer wall because attached to you is destiny. Hear me this morning. If you ever needed to hear the voice of the Lord this morning, this is it. Hear me this morning, everybody under the sound of my voice. In your home, I penetrate through every space that the enemy has tried to occupy. I break through into your bedroom this morning. I had a restless night. I fought in the spirit. I fought because I understand that some of you have been slept. I understand that some of you, the devil came into your bedroom, took over and messed you up. And this morning, you have woken up and you feel disgusted with yourself. Some of you woke up this morning, if I'll be honest. Looking around your surroundings and not recognizing the bed that you woke up in. Because you know that wasn't your bed. Some of you woke up this morning feeling condemned. You woke up this morning feeling like God has given up on you. But I come to reconfigure and to rewire your mind. The best thing you can do this morning is get up, pack your bags and get out from that bedroom that don't belong to you. Enough is enough.
2017 is not going to be like 2016, like 2015. There has to be a change. I said there has to be a change. There has to be a change. My hope is built on nothing less by Jesus' blood and righteousness. That's all I know. I said, listen. On Christ the solid rock I stand. All of the ground is sinking sand. All of the ground is sinking sand. I said, all of the ground this morning, you hear me? All of the ground is sand which sinks. There ain't no strong foundation on, on, on other grounds. Other grounds is sinking sand. You will make the mistake and go and stand on that foundation. Because from the outside, it looks good. But as soon as you put your feet on that foundation, you will sink this morning. All of the ground is sinking sand. I said, all of the ground is sinking sand. Every other ground. You can leave. You can go and try and find another way. You can uh, get you a boyfriend, a girlfriend, a sugar daddy, a sugar mommy, whatever it is. But I'm going to tell you that that ground will be sinking sand. Those grounds is sinking sand. Whilst you sit and relax in 2017, waiting on Jehovah, waiting on the Lamb of God who takes away the sins of this world, I need you to understand something. That he is forever faithful. He is forever pure and he is the righteous judge present your request to him this morning and worry and fret not because he's on the throne bow your heads with me this morning as I pray father we thank you Every name on this wall, I present back to you. And I ask you as the Lamb of God, I ask you as Jehovah, remember that you fashioned and formed every word on this wall. Visit, locate, answer the God that answers by fire. Let that God rise up this morning. Bless us. Favor us. In the name of Yeshua the Christ. The son of the living God. Prayer mantle family. I just rose up this morning to remind you. That your name. Is on the prayer wall of heaven. Angels have been given an assignment. To make sure. That you fulfill. Your assignment and your destiny on this earth for thine is the kingdom the power and the glory forever and ever in Jesus mighty name I pray Amen God bless you this morning family go have a blessed day victory is yours in Jesus precious name God bless you Goodbye. Ha! Yes, Lord. Hey! Halalabasia. Vasovodiva.
la prasute li priyasa. Vaso voti vali vriya. Jesus, we thank you. Ha! I feel God this morning. I feel my help. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Prayer is in the house. I said hallelujah. Prayer is in the house. In Jesus' name. I release it into your house. I release it into your house. In the name of Jesus. God bless you. Have a blessed day. God bless you. Goodbye. Goodbye. I don't want to keep you too long because this is a Saturday. Go do it. Go do your house chores. Replay it if you have to. Hey, there is a strong anointing this morning. I said you got to replay this if you have to because there is power in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name I pray. God bless you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. If you want to be put on the wall, email prayer mantle with the names. We'll add it to the wall, okay? God bless you. Bye-bye.